Macho May and Rooster Brothers. How do you guys not have any Nova Corp member in a fight against Thanos? Love the movie, but just boggles my mind. Didn't even have to be Richard Ryder. I look closely at that scene again, there, and you will see. There are thousands of people. Yeah, you will see Richard true. Ryder in the background of a shot. Easter egg. So if you're new to the channel, my name is Christian and welcome to SeaWorld Production. You guys, the Russo brothers are trolling today. Trolling. So apparently they were asked that why wasn't there any Nova Corps in the final epic massive battle scene of Avengers Endgame, right? There was a broad spectrum of all different fighters from around the galaxy. But there were no Nova Corps. And they were, you know, why? Well, apparently the Russo brothers stated that, yes, you can see Richard Ryder, Nova somewhere in that final battle scene. Now it's hectic. So all the Marvel fans lost their mind when they stated this and they were like, well, let's go shot by shot, frame by frame and see if they can find that Easter egg that the Russo brothers teased. But nobody found nothing. You know why? Because they were just joking. Russo brothers came out and said that it was just a joke. They were just trolling us. We got no Nova at the end of Avengers Endgame. <laughs> Now, that's okay with me, because guess what? Nova is still going to show up in the Marvel Cinematic Universe in some time. Kevin Feige stated that they are going to be working on a Nova Corps film. We're going to see Richard Ryder in the Marvel Cinematic Universe sooner, or, sooner than later, most likely going into Phase 5, Phase 6, because the MCU is going to be massively, massively influenced by the cosmic beings. It's going to be a cosmic feel where we're stating, you know, going into phase four, going into phase five, six, and so and such. It's going to be hugely com... com I can't even talk right now. Hugely cosmic influenced, right? So we can still see him further down the line. You know, and I'm not, I'm not really particularly mad at it because we, we've got a little, a little glimpse of the whole Nova Corps in the first Guardians of the Galaxy movie. We got it. And there's no rush. There's no rush... When, you know, when we're talking introducing, you know, the whole Nova and Nova Corps, there's no rush. We have a lot of good stuff coming out, you guys. A lot of good stuff in Phase 4, a lot of good stuff in Phase 5. Trust me. Trust me, we got some good shit coming. So, I'm still pumped. I'm still thrilled, uh, potentially, hopefully, hopefully to see, you know, Nova in the next Avengers movie. When is the next Avengers movie? Probably not for another five to six, maybe even to seven years. They're in the rebuilding phase of the Marvel Universe. So we got, we got, we have quite some time, you guys. Um, and also, you know, the whole video I did on, you know, the extended director's cut of Spider-Man Far From Home. So excited. Well, apparently Sony came out and confirmed it, stating that it's only four minutes longer of action sequences. Four minutes. That is all. Nothing more, nothing less. Yes, I am going to skip out on this. I don't know why they're re-releasing it. Well, I do know why. It's all about the green. It's all about the money. Labor Day weekend, a lot of people are going to be out. A lot of people are going to be off. So we'll catch a movie. Well, what are we going to watch? Spider-Man Far From Home, the extended version. Oh, gosh. I wonder what they're going to be showing. Not your average moviegoer knows what exactly is going to be in that extended footage. So they're going to they're gonna go in thinking that, oh, man, it's going to be like an extra hour, 45 minutes. No, four minutes tops, and that's it. So I will be skipping now. Definitely gonna have to pre-order. I'll probably pre-order it within the next week, two weeks. You know, get it at Best Buy. Not gonna get the still book, because the still book looks like it's just a clutterfuck of just uh, the marketing team sometimes for this these these Spider-Man movies just don't know how to uh, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, but the marketing team needs help from Disney, or Marvel Studios that is. They they need some help. Not a huge fan of that still book. It's it's pretty ugly. But there you guys have it. No Nova at the end of Avengers Endgame. Russo Brothers trolling us. And Spider-Man Far From Home, only four minutes in the extended edition for the re-release. Post your comments down below, you guys. Let me know what you guys think about Rooster Brothers trolling the fans. And when would you like to see Nova in the Marvel Cinematic Universe? Post your comments down below, you guys. And thank you for taking time today for watching CEO Productions. Peace.